ahead and do some beginner friendly easy makeup tips as I blend out my makeup right here on my face. This is cream makeup. We're going to blend all this out using the buff and blonder brush. Okay. This is a light to medium coverage brush that I'm actually going to be using and we're just going to blend everything out. So if you didn't see part one, go to part one so that you can go ahead and see where the placement is, why everything is placed there for a good reason and how this 3d makeup works. Hi. If y'all are new here, I'm Samantha and I am a makeup artist and esthetician and I love this 3D makeup. I also customize these palettes for you and it's amazing. So you can comment match down below and I'll get you a color match, put you in my free makeup classes so that you can actually learn how to do your makeup with something that's easy. Cause I know it's like, gosh, can I find something that works travel friendly and that I actually have time to do so I'm not in front of the mirror for like an hour that's how I was in the beginning so first what you just saw me do is just actually tap into the product using this end of the blush and bronzer brush this is the main end of this brush that you're actually going to be using and you want to tap you want to make sure that you're tapping not sliding or swiping so if you're doing this stop it mm -hmm, girl it makes a difference. You want to tap it on. You're either going to tap or you're going to blend and do circles. Secondly, make sure your hand is on the back end of the brush. You see how the brush is in thirds? One, two, and three. Make sure your hand's on the back end. You're going to have less pressure on your face whenever you do. And we're just going to tap and blend out from the lightest shades to the darkest shades. Okay. Leaving that contour for last. Ooh. And then I'm like, I can't even talk. I'm like spitting everywhere. And then we're going to go ahead and tap and blend going up and then tap and slide for the contour. But you see how light handed I'm doing it. The reason you want to do it this way is because you're not going to blend away the product. Okay. So tap and slide going up. And then I'm literally just going to go in this angle like this and tap my product in place. Okay. And this is literally how it works. It's so easy. So look how pretty that is. You can set it with a little bit of powder. And once you set it with powder and you would actually use a setting spray too, setting spray and then powder, but I have videos to show you that, but I really just want to make sure you guys understand the placement. You can always add a little bit of a lip and cheek if it's not bright enough for you i like to actually do that with my finger so i can go back into my palette and if i want to build up the color coverage of my blush i can mix colors together i can and then well, bam it's like literally that easy you're fresh 